ni me pretend all along that na kupen na jona juliza messages koni we want to nam to via messages na yuko apana na to via messages to hopefully mali yako mumkumbuka na every time na mkumbuka i feel like calling him texting kumwambia kila kitu lakini no replies imekuwa ngumu sana kumuvota na hata nimekuwa na wewe nilikuwa na, na jaribu na jaribu tu kama naweza pata ukweli kama naweza muvona lakini nimekuwa ngumu mwenyewe huyo mwanaume haja ku reply wewe tu ndio unamtafuta si ndio ndio mimi si mwanaume si ndio mimi si mwanaume ama ni i'm less of a man maybe you can tell me Unaweza niambia nijue? Mimi Unaweza niambia nijue? Nijue. Utasema hivyo text zinamaanisha nini? What is it? What is it unasema tuju? Wewe unachisikia hata ukiongea? Unachisikiza uko na akili nzuri wewe? Uko na akili nzuri? Uko na akili nzuri wewe? Sana tu kama kawaida this F001 your number one online channel where we educate, we entertain and most importantly we empower guys if you new here you know we do it like subscribe and definitely don't forget to share anyway mambo ni mengi basando machache happy new year to everyone tuning and we are so much happy and privileged to be hosting and having you on this platform and if you are tuning in here for the very first time feel welcome feel loved and just know that if you are about to get to marriage when you are in marriage or you just have experience in marriage this is the most welcome place you should be and you should be with a notebook you know to you learn as we are here to educate stack kongea mengi sana you requested for it and i said as a new way this time when you are called upon you must appear tukikupata kwa simu tunakupigia tunakuita hapa this one gentleman who has gone through much at a very tender age i've tried reaching the wife i've tried nimeambia maybe if possible akuje na the other guy which we are hopeful maybe they are coming but before then nataka kuava conversation with the gentleman hapa karibu sana and i can take your presence for granted actually we've been waiting for the better part of the day and i have to say i'm sorry sana for keeping you sije tuanze wapi umesema mama ulipeleka nyumbani eh ndani hiyo mambo haingeenda vingine you know Speaking of Ata, where how how has your journey of love been you and your partner because hata mimi some messages zil ni mesmerize sana. Proise vitu za zingine zinaoma sana. And um safari yangu na yeye inakuwa inakuwa kind of tough sana. Na Kuri msichana kabisa vile alifanya singeamini kama siku moja naweza amka hivi. Yaani nipate vitu kama hizo kwake. Kumbuka kitambo sana wakati tulipatana na yeye. That time sikukua hivi nilivyo. Na nakumbuka tulipendana tu nilikuwa na zungushanga tu delight that time. Mhm. Hizo delight za kupeana unaenda kwa msee unamwambia achukue delight unalipa na commission. So hivi wakati tulipatana na yeye nilikuwa nachunguza hivyo nilipatanga akiwa kwa job alikuwa apiketi mahali tuke exchange namba akuchukua delight hiyo siku. Lakini sasa nikakuwa nikipitia hapo nikimwambia sasa you know delight hata mimi nikaachana vitu na delight so unaona sasa nika nikaanza tu kupenda akakuwa rafiki we kwa rafiki tukaendelea kuongea tukaendelea kuongea paka tukajoana kujoana tukapendana sasa kupendana ni ile sasa harakati ya yes i've tried naona this is working for me 
she's good for me naweza mkubali kwa maisha yangu sasa tuishi nele kuishi bro ni kweli msichana nilimpenda nikaenda kwao hawakukua na shida mingi kwanza na kumbukanga baba yao alinipenda tu hivyo vile unapata nanga na mshe tu yani anaku like tu generally anakupenda tu Baba yule msichana alinikubali yani kabisa anikubali kabisa mimi nikakaa kama ni mtoto wake anakumbuka hata hata time yenye niliendanga hiyo siku yenye walituruhusu ni sawa sasa tunaweza ishi pamoja hata hakuniitisha zile vitu zinaitisha ngo ati za ati akuita wazee ati ukuje ndio mnegotiate a price ya msichana a uh, the dower and everything lakini kitu moja nakumbukanga aliniambia <coughs> nimekuona unakaa mtu integrity sana na unakaa mtu unaweza ukanjituma. Mm. Aliniambia mimi nakupea baraka zangu. Mm-hmm. And then tu Mungu atawabariki. Akaniambia watu wa wazali wangu na vitu vitu wapata kwa njia. Sasa unajua ile kidogo chenye nilikuwa nacho ndio nilipatia mzee tukaenda na kabisa I respect baba yake kabisa. Mm. Na na respect family yake kabisa. Mm. Tulienda hivyo tuka uh, uh, tukaoana kidogo tukaendelea kuishi pamoja tu kwa tumepata mtoto that time mm. alipata ngo na shinda ya ya backbone yake backbone yake ilikuwa na shinda sasa ikaenda hapo akakuwa ni kuwekwa hospitali mm. akakuwa hapo mimi nikakuwa <coughs> namtembelea kila wakati namtembelea kila wakati ilifika ngo mahali ikapasist baka ikabindi na kumbukanga manager wangu akiniambia sasa of zako zimeenda zime exist zime sana like uh, live zenye ilikuwa namwambia si yuko kazi leo si yuko job na unaelewa ile kazi ni ya marketing tadi ilifika hivyo tu handi kabindi ni hivyo tu ndio ilikuwa ni lose that job kwa sababu yake mm. ha tukaendelea kandelea bili kakuwa kubwa sana kidogo ya hospitali haikusiku iweza kuilipa na kumbukanga that time ni kuanga na ngombe bili nyumbani that time hiyo ndio kitu ya kwanza nilianza niliuza kwa sababu yake ya ugonjwa wake pia bila nikatafuta marafiki pia bila haiku haiku nisaindika sana so nikaona sasa nime lose job na eh, kila kitu yenye niko nayo haiko so what i did nilienda nikakata nika shamba kangu yenye niko nayo katiwa nikasema nalipa bill na hii kwa sababu Mungu amenisaidia na phone na kwa mzuri hii ingine nataka ni anzishe kwa biashara na yenyewe sasa nikijua kama nitapata wale wengine mahali hivyo ndivyo nilifanya tukakilia bill akuja sasa unajua ni ile huwezi muacha sasa nikakaa na yeye kaeka kanduka hapo na hizo pesa zenye zilibaki. Mm-hmm. Kaendelea tu kachapa chapa kazi hapo. Shukuru Mungu kwa sababu baadaye nilikujanga kupata kazi nyingine. So hapo sasa before hapo na kabisa nilimweka hapo akakuwa na supervisor akatafuta mtu mwingine wakati sasa alikuwa mchamzito. Sasa bro mimi ile jani ni mahoku na huyu msichana nimekuwa hata kutoka ile siku kuna kosa upendo ni nini kwa sababu kama ni mapenzi yangu mimi nimeonyesha my full support nimemsupport bro Mungu amenisaidia hata niko na I have a, a senior of, of, official anafanya kazi na government nimefanya hata ku recommend brother wake na sister wake wote sahihi they are in good peace sleep and it's true me si semi like nataja yote yenye ni anjo wewe ni bro naweza kueleza mm. si semi nataja ati yenye nimesaidia yote lakini i am telling you vile mimi ningefanya kama unapenda mtu i have done it i have really done it with might yani ile kitu yenye inaniuma mpaka wa sasa ni kwa sababu nikiangalia left right sioni yani reason inaweza fanya huyo msichana anifanye hivi vitu nilifanya kwa maisha yake 
yani najichunguza mpaka hata najiuliza ama mimi kweli siwezi kama simwezi na sijui unajua naweza kuwa unafanya everything lakini kwe amridhishi bado kwani hata time ulikuwa unamkatea ama ulimforce kuingia box si kumforce kuingia box tulipendana tu akakubali tu kienda kwao ni kitu hata alikubali si ati ulimharakisha alikubali si kuamharakisha in fact nakumbukanga hata mimi hiyo time kwanza before niliona hata ita niliona kaa tutakaa sana tukidet sikujua hata itaingiana hivi mapema kwa sababu uh, nilikuja kugundua si in for it na yeye pia alikuwa mbembe alikuwa me ni vibe tulikuwa vibes zilikuwa zishaingiana asi kum force anything mimi na inafika dio place alisema sijui i be lying if i say or pretending if i say that i have a husband kitu kama hiyo ana kutoka hiyo siku na lala pia nikifikiria ni nini naweza fanya anifanyie hivyo ama ni nini umekuwa kwa maisha yake yenye aoni husband hapo ama what is the definition of a husband yenye sikuelewa mimi najua husband ni ku provide najua husband ni ku take care ya kijenya kono ya kijenya ya familia yake i have done that i have done that extraordinary wewe bro nikwambie with this kind of economy unajua alini alivuta job tu from nowhere hajafanya makosa hajafanya anything yani siku moja tu aliamka hivi tu akasema aende kazi nikamketisha chini kamuliza why why don't you see we still need finance ama tumejitosheleza hizo vyote zenye unaweza kataa kazi tu hizo tu na waachana na nini akaniambia yeye hataki kufanya kazi nikamwambia ni sawa nikamwacha hiyo siku nikaenda na nikakuja siku mbili tatu nikafikiria kwa sababu pia nilitaka nimuelewe is it that anasumbuliwa na mimi unajua in work station unaweza kuna sumbuliwa hata na boss anasumbuliwa na, na kila mtu hapo mimi anakutaka and maybe you are too faithful utakifikia mahali too uncomfortable mm. your environment unasema tu wache kaya but she not open up nilimuuliza tu akaniambia ni hivyo ni hivyo so mafikira zangu nikachipea mimi anapata vitu kama hizo anasumbuliwa nikasema fine thank you wacha basi nikamwambia fikiria kazi nataka kuweka mimi nikuwekea kazi hmm. this can be in e in hume na mimi tunahitaji yani yani you know i no search wildly gata. bro mm-hmm. i search wildly nimejaribu kutafuta reason yenye inaweza inaweza fanya yani huyo mtu mm? afunifanyie hivyo sisi kama amefika kuje tu hata na ambiwa ni kama amefika hey. amwambie tu akuje tu Hey, hata si kujua mani kitu naweza yongelelea mimi. Mama ko depressed ama sometimes. Kwa nini nilikwambia nini wewe? Nilikuwa pia ntombo ni kama mna yeye. Okay, so to get it to love that to acha to explain it to tafadhali. Nilisema kama afiki hapa, hakuna kitu tunaweza ongea mimi na yeye. I am telling you bro. Kuja. Kwa heshima yako. Mama mimi bado hujamleta. Mleta Aezi leta. Sasa analeta. Si anajua kuna mjingo wake anakuja kufula hapa. Anajua. Anajua. Are you willing to talk kama bado utatuambia uende nyumbani? Mbona hujaleta? Hebu keti hapo niambie why you have to. You know I have serious things to do bro. Sahi ni saa ngapi? Hatuwezi ongea kama huyo mtu ayuko hapo. Tunaongelelea nini na mtu ayuko? Mbona hujakuja? Hizi hii kesi imekuwa ni kesi ya watu watatu. Mimi ningependa anisikize. Nini na msikiza? Na no, usiseme tu sikizi, kiambi usikizi uonge. Unajua sasa mimi napatianga watu chance. Sikiza huyu, sikiza huyu. Mtu akikuja kuna progress. Unajua mtu akikufula na dhaningi utaishi kuwa maisha yako kuwa a full tu. Sasa hizi ni gani tena? Hizi ni gani? Uko tayari kuonge. Na nani anaongea na nani? Ako wapi mwenye bwana wake mwingine? Sio ni bwana wake. Hata mimi si bwana wake. Fanya. Uko na bwana. Daddy wewe usilisikia. Wewe usilikuwa ni hiyo message. Julio, suliona akisema hata She will be lying to see ananipenda mimi ama mimi ni bwanake. Yaani anabega hata mtu una, una simple kwa mwanaume na sasa unakuja kunifula hapa ati ati ujakuja na yeye bado. Unajua mimi bado ni mjingo wako. Naomba tu shuke chini. Ni 
Kiongozi fanya tu hivi kwa ile Kiongozi kwa heshima yako fanya hivi kwa ile heshima yangu nimekuwa mngwana sana kwa maisha yake kwa maisha yake hata wewe akusikizi hata wewe akusikizi sikiza tu akusikiza amekuja kukuomba turudiane nataka tu niambie the first 3 minutes kama ni sensible nilikwambia condition yangu ama aje ulimwambia ama ukumwambia nilimwambia na mamia yupo ni kijaribu kukonvince. Hata heshima yako hakuna, hata heshima yako hakuna yenye iko hapo. Fanya hivi. Unajua tuketi tu tumpate first 3 minutes. Asipongea sense. Walk away. Sasa sense gani? Sense gani wewe ukiona? 3 minutes. Kama bado unaniambia utatuambia utatuambia ni utuambie sense. Sisi hakuna kitu tutafanya. Hapata mimi nita walk away this time. Sasa tuwezi ngoja hapa na hakuna kitu tunaambiwa. Hey. Unajua mtu akikuzoea <laughs> ni na shukuru mmenita hapa na poleni sijakuja na watu poleni gani unasema poleni gani ningependa ungependa nini ungependa. kama ungependa kama ulikuwa mtu anataka amani ungekuja na huyo tusuluishe unataka tusuluishe nini hapa sasa na hatuna roots umekuja ya, hapa hebu atuambie huyo anataka kwa wapi mbona hujakuja na yeye in 3 minutes tu tuelewe sababu sija kuja na watu ni kwa sababu mimi ni mjinga watu na unajua vile hiyo kitu inauma bro watu tulikuwa na yeye kitamu na kwa sababu damu hakuna na na simp na na simp kwake ana simp kwa hiyo watu si ndio mimi sikutoshelezi watu hakuna damu ndio wewe sasa uanze kusimpu kwa wanaume mbona hajakuja at the same time unapata karinji ya kukanyanga kanyanga hapa peke yako mm -hmm. reason anto hajakuja kwa sababu ni kitambo sana tumekuwa naye kitambo na nakumbuka hiyo text ilikuwa ya lini kwa nini ulituma lini hiyo text ndio useme ni kitambo message ni ya ni ya new year Taremoja. Sasa mtu mwenye hizi ni vitu gani bro? Hatuna kitu kingine ya maana ya kufanya hizo ni vitu gani unasikia akisema? Ati vile nimekwambia tu. Tunakupatia 3 minutes. Then to analyze. Hakuna mtu anako distract sitaongea 3 minutes ujitete. Usipojitetea mami hata mimi nimekwambia this time I'm walking away. Your 3 minutes begins now. Asante. Hmm. Sababu sija kuja na mtu anto ni kitambo tumekuwa na yeye mwisho tuliona na anto ilikuwa 2020 april akaniambia ana anafaa kusafiri sawa so, wakati alikuwa anasafiri alisafiri in november wakati alikuwa anasafiri aliniambia ali, alimpigia asubuhi kama toka Kufika jioni akanipigia tena lakini sikushika simu Akapiga mara sita nilipata missed calls zake sita Sikushika sababu simu yangu ilikuwa silent so, na hata sikuwa na expect anipigie hiyo saa nilikuwa na expect anipigie labda kama ameshafika Sasa wakati nilijaribu kupiga mtu alishika niliambia nifikie Kenyatta Sasa hapo nikashtuka Nikawa naacha nifikie haraka ini namba ya antu tunia na tuni naambiwa nifikie Kenyatta kwa nikuna nini so hapo ndo nikaenda Kenyatta nikapata familia yake iko hapo marafiki zake wenye nilikuwa najua kina Ken wote wako hapo lakini mood walikuwa nayo ilikuwa somba mood sasa mimi nikajaribu naangalia hii mood lakini hakuna mtu ananiongelesha Ken akaniambia Mr. Comrade. But I'm 
totally pass. Your November 11, 2020. <laughs> Najua amwezi elewa. Uchungu nimepitia kusikia anto amekufa. Anto tumetoka na mbali. Anto alikuwa my first boyfriend. Tume plan vitu mingi na anto tuli plan to get married kukuwa na watoto tuli plan kukuwa na maisha poa lakini hiyo time alikuwa feeling heartbreak niliona nikaa dunia imeisha big sina hope stena siko na hopes Tangu anto kufu sijai pati ya mtu chance kumaisha yangu. Sijai kuwa na mtu. Tangu yu siku. Nimejaribu kumubu on. No, nikapata, nikapata manasi. Nilikuwa nafikiria niki move on na manasi. Nita get over everything. Kukuwa na watoto nilikuwa nataka. Nilikuwa nafikiria. Nitapenda mana sebe nilikuwa napenda tu. This is a ring. Antoni gave me. Najua anashanganga mbona na iva haja iju. Tulikuwa engaged already. John Mokosea. You may pretend all along that Nakupen. Najuna Juliza, messages, Connie, we want to. Nam to be a messages na yuko Apana. Natuma messages to hopefully. Mali yako, mu mkumbuka. Na every time na mkumbuka, I feel like calling him, texting. Kumambia kila kitu, lakini no replies. Ime kuangumu sana kumuvonda. Nata nimekuwa na wewe. Nikuwa na, na jaribu, na jaribu tu, kama neza pata, ukweli kama neza move on, lakini mekongu. Umenisaidia sana, umesaidia familia yangu. Umenitoa mbali manase sezi kata. kwamba tumsamaa labda indo maisha nilipangiwa sidhani kama nita get over it because every time i remember tony and tony
kabla indo karma ile tunaitanga karma indo karma mana se ab sorry don't accept me back simu dakika moja tu please kwenye simu yako tulishona kila kitu so hmm dakika tu ku confirm kitu hapo kwa simu story na simu ndio ile tai kitu yote haina haja I just wanted to confirm kama huyu atola ja hii reply za vitu zote only that na anda ni mwachia ya mobile anataka na tu ni ambivi lunaona niangalie tu hiyo simu tu hivi just to confirm if it is something true we can see on what to comment about uko na simu hapo Anta ja reply. Anta ja wa reply. Hebu nione tu ni clarify tu kitu. Once ni hivyo. Mimi I'll only ask for your final decision then you will say yaki when you all know the truth because it's good to build something on the truth. Kona ya simu imezima Simu ingine ni msina sasa sana Kuba labda uni ambie your opinion Cuz you know yourself best Kiongozi. Just leave the back point. Simu iko mimi sina shida. Mimi labda ni waache tu ya. Achie yes. Achie yes. Asante kwa kufuatilia, asante kwa kujaribu kuleta mawasiliano lakini just leave it at that point. Mimi na heshima na hata ni kitu hiyo point sikaki hata mambo mengi ama nini kwa intrude ama nini